All right, I started it. We're just going all the way from the top of the movie again. Yeah, we're just going to start the movie over again and just do it all over. Yeah, definitely awesome. not. Definitely not. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> all right, so exactly this movie, this movie was called Six Assassins, and it was made in 1971, and it was a Shaw Brothers film production. Uh, out of ten, what would you guys give? Uh, the plot of the movie. Well, we actually came down with a summary of the movie. Right, so the summary of the movie is uh, the Emperor's brother is going nuts, fucking shit up, and the minister hires six assassins to kill his ass. Yes, crazy brother of the Emperor who needs to die by the hands of six assassins. I like that one better. <laughs> um, for the plot, I'm gonna give it... I'm gonna give it a... S Six. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a six. I think I, I personally think that's a little generous. I'm gonna give it a five because it lost the whole point. Because I, I just I just questioned it. The whole time I was questioning why are there seven characters and it's because there's six assassins and then the one lady. Yeah, they didn't count the wo they didn't count the woman, which was pretty messed up. Typical seventies shit. Yeah. So it's six assassins, he man woman haters. All right. Yeah. Next category. Uh, let's see. Oh wait, wait. I give the oh, plot. Yeah. I give the plot. Uh, there's like no plot. I don't even care for the plot. I give the plot a three. <laughs> oh man, I was hella generous. <laughs> you were so generous. <laughs> okay, okay. So I gave it a three. Uh, Alex gave it a. I gave it a six. Six and Junior, you gave it a. I gave it a five because there's five. definitely there's definitely something there that I would put inside of a sandwich. I just think that mm. this was a bad sandwich. Yeah, yeah I agree. Oh, I like that. I like that analogy. Acting. <laughs> I will give it a solid four in acting. I I did miss out on a big chunk of the movie. But I would still give it a five because what I did see, even the extras were, were kind of important. And they did a good job there. But there's def I, I definitely know that there's got to be worse movies out there. There's probably worse movies out, out there. I mean, it is an old film. Uh, expressions were on point. Every single eye shot. Ching, ching. <laughs> <laughs> Their lines. We're delivered with enough oomph. Yeah, yeah, I'm even yeah. watching his facial expressions right now, and he's still got, he's got, okay, I'll give it maybe a little too much oomph at times. Little, yeah, yeah, but it, everything's over the top, which is kind of normal which for us. Which is why, film. like I said, it's a total, it's a total of five. Like, there's I'm definitely a, things that, you know, could have been better. Yeah, I'll, but it I'm wasn't gonna the go, worst out there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a five. I'm being kind of generous on the, <laughs> on the acting. All right. Ooh, ooh. Cinematography. Okay, so ooh. I'm going to give the cinematography, I'm going to give it a six. Um, it wasn't amazing. Obviously, it's an old movie, but I feel like there wasn't too much, like, wasted space in each shot. Which is pretty amazing. Yeah, they had fantastic angles. So uh, definitely, you know, and, and and the colors, everything was 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 great. This very, is my favorite scene right here. Yeah, that, that's the one you didn't see, Junior. Very epic, Chinese, oh, you know, I miss classic Chinese uh, style. Yeah, I'm gonna give this the best fight scene there because that was probably one single take. Like <laughs> cinematography, I'm gonna give it a six. I'm definitely that's a that's a six for me. I mean, I really liked some of it. But I think near the end of the film, everything started to slow down and it started to to uh, draw out. They started using just same same kind of shots, even though, I mean, the last <laughs> maybe 15 minutes was just fight scenes. <laughs> but at the beginning, every single angle was like crazy throughout the most of the movie from the beginning for like the, the first third of it. This really is, honestly, Nikonsi, I'm gonna have to agree with you. We're on the we're on the fight scene where uh Jung Jie is on the uh, bridge. This fight scene was badass. And I think it's like, yeah, definitely great use of angles, great use of shots and amazing. Look at boom. Choreography was so dope on that one. Oh yes. 
definitely gonna give it a six because the shots that were amazing were just I'll remember them, and then a lot of the other shots that weren't were like. Okay, All right. score of the film, the musical soundtrack. <laughs> let me tell, let me oh, tell you, it was, boy. It was too much sometimes, but the musical number that they have was phenomenal. We're still, are we still recording? <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, we're still good. Um, I'm gonna give the music. Uh, I'm gonna give it a so bad it, it's good yeah that type pretty, of score that's a pretty good so so i'll give it a i'll give it a five smack dab in the okay. middle five i'm with them on the so bad is good because that kind of that that kind of music is fun to play and it, it wasn't it wasn't you know the worst and i think it was used pretty well but it was also really cheesy <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, really? I'm just, I'm just a sucker for that kind of music. So <laughs> cheesy, so cheesy. Uh, Nikansi, so what did you give it? I gave it a five. What did you give it? Also a five. A five. Nikansi? I gave it a, a five out of ten. All right. Yeah. All right. I would not play that music in my ride. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's next? Ooh, most important, the action choreography. Yes. All right, Nikon. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see. They had ten fight scenes total in a movie that is an hour and nineteen minutes long. About three of the fight scenes I found were pretty damn good, choreography-wise, and they were like badass to watch. So I want to say I would give this film. Mm, out of 10 for fight scenes, I'm going to probably do a 6 out of 10. I'm just such a harsh critic. <laughs> um, I don't know. I think, I think that's pretty fair. I'm going to give it a 5, personally. Um, they haven't really gotten down the uh uh i i don't know I, I could see like sometimes where someone was pretending to hit somebody and you could see the gap between the fist and the <laughs> guy's actual face a few times i'm like they still haven't gotten that shit down so um they're definitely still yeah they they're definitely still in the art of mastering that so i'm gonna give it a give it a five Especially with the long range jumping and <laughs> literally jumping from the ground through the roofs. Yeah, that was that was kind of intense. A little too many with the freak moments. Uh, I'm also going to give it uh, a, and I feel, you feel like you're being harsh. I feel like I'm being generous when I give it a six because uh, just like with a lot of the, a lot of the other shots, just like with the cinematography, like there's some of those fights were amazing and unfortunately I missed the best one just seeing a couple seconds of that one but uh, <laughs> we're literally watching a scene right. <laughs> where the sword bounces off the bamboo Captain America shield style and comes back and stabs him in the back and and that's where I have to that's this is where I draw the line of like is it cinematography or choreography at that point because that that was just that just happened. There wasn't actually any martial arts being shown. There wasn't any sort of, you know, dancing or uh, forms. That was just a. I mean, like for sure, points for creativity. But sometimes you just gotta say, "What the freak?" That shit was hilarious. Okay, overall score for this film. I would give it a 4 out of 10. Uh, I'm gonna give it a 6 out of 10. I'm gonna go off the scale and use our own personal scale of so so bad it's good. There was a lot going on in, in this movie and uh, again like I said I missed out on a decent chunk of it unfortunately but what I did get to witness it was over the top, zany, and I couldn't take it too seriously the entire time. What's the number score for you? That would be, that would be a five. A five. Okay. It's so bad. 
that it still gets recommended. I think it's yes. a, <laughs> so. So both of you say it's so bad it's good. Uh, no, I'm giving it a six. Okay, I say it is a bad film. I am also <laughs> jumping on that one. It is bad. But Junior, you say it's a five out of ten. I, I like. Oh, I said but earlier, it's so bad I'm, it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's easy for me to recommend somebody to watch it, and that's what I think of is the bottom line five like somebody would enjoy watching this yeah like you're you're going out of w your way to watch a bad movie and yeah those are just yeah. great nights yeah yeah that, yeah that's true that's true this was extremely entertaining <laughs> let's see we also have training scenes which there really was no training scenes zero training scenes yeah. there was a glimpse of them training behind the some of the characters talking um, but they were just do it basically just shuffling their feet which to be fair as far as a category like a minor category to keep track of uh, I think that's also uh, mainly about what the plot is and this plot was not about the story of some homies getting strong to like go kill some guy there is these were like six <clears throat> seven masters the already ready to go and get revenge the Black Ranger was amazing. Yes. The absolutely amazing. He had the best fight scenes. He, from what His I fight saw, scenes he were my favorite. He definitely had the coolest sword play. Now we have what the freak moments. The first what the freak moment we have is 16 minutes into the film. All eggs are broken when the nest is overturned. That's the quote I've been looking for. So this is this is what I was talking about. This this is the scene that totally foreshadows like they're gonna reuse that shot eventually. They're getting attacked by it. Nico. Nico. This is see look, I told you. Oh cool. yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. This is this is the that hidden. was like I have no idea what's going on. And then he jumped super high into the tree. That was some funny shit and then he just fell yeah he jumped up and stabbed him <laughs> so i think this is a good unified we were all like that was what a thing that was a shot just happened <laughs> out of nowhere after talking okay the next one that we have was at the 34 minute mark oh this is where they open <laughs> they open the uh what looks like a coffin where somebody's sleeping in Every single one of the assassins just jump onto the roof <laughs> as the guy's yawning. <laughs> just like a cat. Yeah. <laughs> what was Black Ranger's actual name? I don't know. Maybe we'll no, find out right let's now. Let's see here. I don't even think they. I don't know. Pay me the rent. He's obviously drunk. He he's got the uh, the flask on the, the side. gourd. The gourd. That's what There's it's called. There's a freaking name. I was looking for that. I was just trying to figure that out. The gourd. I was uh, thinking it was Harito, but I am <laughs> just Mexican as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think we're going to get the name. It just goes straight into a fight scene. <laughs> it's just Black Ranger. Oh, I think this was one of your favorite uh, Ooh, fight scenes. Oh, yes. This fight scene was absolutely fantastic. <laughs> Boom. Boom. The Black Ranger just fights nonstop. And again, I this think is he's I'm the only one that fights right? the whole time. This is what I was talking about. Right? Like some of the shots... That was a good shot. Yeah, they use all the effects to like to black out the fake hits and whatnot. See, if the whole movie was like this, this fight Ooh, scene, that was a good stab right there. <laughs> then it would have been, it would have been, it would have, I would have gave it a higher score. But it started getting like slow, slow here and drawn out. Yeah, if they had enough plot to to kind of save those slow moments you know what another thing there wasn't any humor no i don't think that that comes until later later kung fu films really yeah okay. yeah 70s was kind of this style but they were making them so fast yeah no i saw that you already had like i, I don't even know like <laughs> how much we had to scroll just to get through your 70s <laughs> and films. we and we did a random <laughs> we just like <laughs> boom that one fuck yeah the next what the freak moment was 
Oh, I think this is where she got crucified. Oh yeah, yeah. We are. The so, wife. We just walk in and boom. This was she's Jun, up against the wall. Jun Jay's uh, wife. Not a spoiler. Not a provocative. Spoiler. Way. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're into crucifixion, then you just have, boom. You have some other things like what the out. heck? Yeah, because we were starting to feel for his his family loyalty. <laughs> Then we have at the hour and 13 minute mark, which is near the end of the film, another what the freak moment. Jesus. I forgot what happens here. Oh, this was a decent fight scene. I cannot. I cannot enjoy this leopard. Oh, oh when they that was, that was <laughs> when they jump right through the roof. Yeah, yeah, that's fantastic. I can't handle that leopard robe though. That's too much. I'm telling you, this, like, if we English know this, it would just, <laughs> that guy's voice would be. Um, if we kung pow it. Yeah, it'd be really, really nasally, like. <laughs> and then the last, last one, at the minute 15 mark. Spoiler, I mean, hour 15 spoiler mark. Spoiler alert. Yeah. <laughs> this is, this Captain is America cool. sword out of nowhere just flies everywhere and stabs him right through the back. <laughs> and then he gets his eyes pinned and he still continues the fight. All right. So our review for this movie, I gave it a bad. Alex gave it a bad. And Khan gave it so bad it's good. Now we have four different ending reviews that we give it so not only do we give it a number score out of 10 um, overall score and then we have the plot score choreography acting cinematography and the music score um, but we also give it a grade of either it's a badass film a bad film an ass film because it's so horrible <laughs> And a so bad it's good. This one I gave it a bad. Yeah. And then yes, I gave it a bad as well. I don't think uh, I would recommend it to too many people. But Mr. Khan. And, and <laughs> I gave it a so bad it's good. Because there's sometimes you purposely want to see a cheesy kung fu movie that makes no sense. And is bad. But you still want to have good stuff in it. So I think that, I think that I'm pretty fair maybe a little too generous in giving it is so bad it's good um review i got gotcha. you i i don't think i'd recommend it to too many people but i definitely enjoyed the movie with good company yes yeah, sir <laughs> so underneath um our video posts i'm actually going to be putting a link to where you can watch the film or buy the film uh, because some people have it on youtube as well and we're also going to be putting up a link to uh, a written review. And if you agree or disagree with our comments, go ahead and uh, leave us a comment. Heck yes, and uh, make sure you all subscribe to our YouTube channel, which will be named when you release this. Something very soon. Something, <laughs> yeah. something very soon. Not, not ten tickles. <laughs> ten tickles. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a that's a different that's a different channel. That'll be on Tumblr. <laughs> Shit, on on freaking yeah, on Grinder. Uh, <laughs> all right, y'all. Uh, anything else y'all want to add at the end? Here? Oh, thank you for joining us, watching our video. If you want other terrible commentary on video games, I have an entire Twitch TV channel set up for that. Uh, uh, Twitch.tv slash cookie ninja harvey. Harvey is spelled like larvae, like the bug, or the killer, instead of the bug. You'll, you'll, we can link it somewhere. It's probably a good idea. I think they're going to struggle with the spelling. All right, you guys. <laughs> Have a good night. Thanks for joining us. Peace.